Hello and welcome to my game devlog number one. In this video series, I'm gonna be showing you the ins and the outs of my game as I get ready to launch it later this year. The name of the game itself is Sumber, which stands for Super Ultra Mega Battle Royale. And honestly, when I picked this name, I just wanted to pick something that was just goofy and trolly and not to be taken too seriously. So I thought this was a perfect description of exactly what this game is. And if you're wondering exactly what this game is, it is a 2D platformer battle royale, a mix of Jetpack Joyride, Fall Guys, Mario Kart, and literally some other other games the current version that is released to the public that you are seeing on your screen right now is the pre-alpha version that was released last year so this is a very old version of the game two to eight players couch co-op I've had many play tests and play sessions with different people and everyone seems to be having a blast so I thought to myself the only next steps to do to continue the development of this game is to add online multiplayer because not everyone's gonna have seven other people right next to them to play with and that's exactly why I'm making this video to bring you along every step of the way showing you exactly how I'm going to continue developing this game. So before we actually start writing any online multiplayer code, the first thing I wanted to do was to actually just make things look better and better structured. So as you can see, this is the old version of the game, how the menu looks and Boom, this is the new version of the game. It looks so much better. I did so many design changes just so I can just get myself ready to actually work on the multiplayer of this game. Not only did I make the menu system just look better and be more efficient and just more intuitive for the user, but I actually also made some in-game changes as well because previously in the old version of the game, this is how it looks, it was pretty bare bones, but now in the current version that I am working on right now, there's so much more on the screen. As you can see on the bottom right corner of the screen, you have the UI control which this can actually be configured to a PlayStation controller, an Xbox controller, Nintendo Switch controller, or even just using mouse and keyboard on PC. And then also at the very top of your screen in the middle, you have all the different player cards, which shows your player health. And then of course, your little super meter at the bottom there, which you can actually build up throughout the course of the game and then activate your ultimate. So as a developer, I use this tool called Trello, which is a, a glorified checklist that developers use really, but it really just helps me visualize and put everything in line so I could see exactly what I'm trying to accomplish and when I should try to accomplish it. So right now, my highest priority on this game is to get the online multiplayer implemented, which in order to do that, I need to have online multiplayer capable of two to eight players playing both on private custom lobbies and public matchmaking and in order to do that I need a private lobby which allows a player to create a private custom lobby and then also I need to sync player movement and player actions over the server that's kind of just an overview of everything that you will be seeing in future videos in this game devlog series I just wanted to show you that so you can just have an understanding of what to expect that's pretty much it for me in this video I really hope you enjoyed it and I hope you are excited to see more game development stuff on this channel especially with some and if you actually want to play the older pre-alpha version of Sumber, just go to the link in the description and you could play the old version. It is currently only available on PC and it's only couch co-op and it's super old. So some of the functionality that I just showed you in this video is not on there. But if you want to get a taste of how the game kind of plays, you can just go ahead and play that uh, before the full game releases or even before the multiplayer beta releases. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to give it a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already i would really really appreciate that anyway i'm a day fier and i have really nothing else to say so i'm just gonna go ahead and end the video i'll see you guys in the next one peace